Hello people, I'm back in the world of Ark on the uh, Primitive Plus server, awesome! Right then, today I'm going to build myself a cannon, oh yes, alright, uh, probably hungry, yep, starving and cold. Uh, food, eat food, job done. Right then, so this is part of the update and uh, oh yeah, the other part of the update is this. We now get Primitive Plus items in drops. Awesome. So no longer will you get fabricated uh, pistols and things like that in it that you can't really use because normally we get like blueprints for stuff that we can't actually craft. So now they fixed it. So all the drops will only have Primitive Plus stuff in, which is kind of awesome. Uh, we'll take that so another one spawns in. I already got a pike out there as well. Ooh, wow, wow, it was getting dark. Uh, gamma 4. <sighs> right then. The chimes that signal darkness. Right. Um, yeah. So we're going to get a cannon. And I'm guessing uh, it's going to be the same as the arc cannon. So once you plonk it down, it's basically set and you can't move it. All you can do is tilt it up and down and that's not very good. So we're going to need to get a parasaur, really. Uh, this is not like PvP, so I mean having a cannon really doesn't benefit uh, like PvE. Uh, suppose you could use it to like blast some big dinos out of the way. I mean like a Bronto or something like that. Which we shall do. We shall uh, get a Paraceratherium. Well, we need to tame one first, so we'll have to go out and get one. And then we shall put a saddle on it and then make one of these cannons just to see if there's any sort of kind of difference to it. Um, I'm just going to put some uh, bits and bobs in the trough. And then we can go out. Uh, yeah, put some medjo berries and some of them as well. And for you meaty guys, you can have some of that. There you go. Because uh, we have the ability to cook. Since we did the industrial stuff in the last video. Uh, I'm feeling like uh, we should have coal and things in there. But never mind, we've got coal in here. Awesome. And yeah, we've got a buttload of cooked meat in there. So I'll transfer that and I'll put that in. In, uh, we'll put some in here for the meaty dinosaurs because it lasts a little bit longer than uh, normal meats. So it's better to cook it up, uh, and then it won't uh, it won't spoil as quick as. And I feel like we should have some over this way. So I've got my raptors back. Uh, my raptors, for some reason, they like to find the way over that side of the fence. Uh, I've got a feeding trough around here. Oh, there it is. And there it is. Uh, I've got some spare ribs in there. Man, these dinos are getting fine dining. Fine dining indeed. Uh, a blueprint for that. And what's that pike one? This is the one that I got out of the drop. So for a primitive, that's 121% uh, damage. That's not bad. And that's 129 Anyway, I'm waffling on and I'm going sidetracked. So, oh, stuff. Need my taming stuff, which is in, I uh, believe, this one. Yes. Right, so we'll have... Uh, ooh, 187. Mm, we'll have that. And we'll plop that there. And we'll get 50 arrow. 50 arrows should be enough, surely. Uh, I don't know what level Pyrocerotherium, and I'm not really bothered, to be fair, because, I mean, it's not going to be doing anything other than having a cannon on it. We're not going to be, um, well, we may do, like, go out and do some taming on it, because they are pretty tanky anyway. Uh, right then, uh, you need to go back to the Redwood biome, and, oh, right then. So we need to check the cannon. Right. Can na 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 oh. sausage. So this uh, this is crafted at a smithy, right? So that should be um, the right amount of materials that we need. 
because we had a heck of a time. Uh, well, I did, sorry. I had a heck of a time because um, the requirements that you needed in the Ingram points were a lot less than you actually needed at the bench. And, yeah, and it can only be crafted at the advanced workbench. Oh, so I spent a load of time crafting stuff up that I didn't actually need. Right, 950 ingots. Uh, the rest of the stuff I've got. Cemented paste, I've got that for days. I've got, like, uh, mood guys over here. And they are... Well, I only need three, and I've got three snails. So they should have... Yep. So that's one. And two. And he's still got some tasty cakes in from the other day. And awesome. And three. And we'll put that in there with the rest of it. So you can see I'm good for paste. All good. And uh, metal. Uh -huh. So I did craft some metal up. Up at the um, forge. And I have a feeling I might have to go out and uh, craft some more. So let's just have a look. Where did we put the metal? So we need 900. Oh god. Uh, so two, yeah, I'm gonna, oh, two, four, six, it's looking good, did I've got any in here, no, so I've got 600, so I did like say 300 odd, but I like to do some more anyway, um, right, I'm gonna fast travel over to, uh, the smithy, uh, the smithy, the, the industrial forge, uh, so I need, have we got, a place that I can eh, put all my stuff. Right, well, I'll say I need to find it. I'll save that. So we'll transfer the foundations into there. Uh, any other building materials? Uh, no. So there's a mixture in there of all sorts, really. I really got some of my cabinets out, but never mind. Uh, armor and imp uh, there, there. blueprints and stuff will go in there. So we'll transfer that. And right. So I'll transfer all this stuff out of my inventory. I'm probably going to come back anyway uh, before this actually despawns. Right, so that's full. Uh, next one. Uh, transfer all that. Accept. How much room we got? Mm -hmm. Right. Get naked. Uh... There we go. I will say, we'll take it off. Could do with the repair. So we're burnt naked as the day we were born. Apart from we've got underwear on. And now we're going to fast travel. So this is what I normally do anyway. Uh, when I first log in, uh, I transfer over to the tree sat base. Uh, empty the taps, which... Uh, you're with me, so I might as well do it. So I respawn... At there. Uh, now, I've only built one bed, like a sausage. Right, so I'm over this way. So what I normally do is... Ooh, 18. We didn't leave it long enough. It's because I'd, I'd uh, basically shut the server down after I'd uh, finished doing my shenanigans. But anyway, so I first log in. Empty these out. Uh, now I'll go over to the forge and now we'll put this in this one there we go so the tree sap will now build up while I'm doing other things on the server which is a good thing because the, there's no point in having just 20 slots filled in there and then it's like it can't do anymore so now it's all empty it's raring to go again and we're going to get a buttload of stuff. Right, what's in this one? Nothing important. Uh, I should really build another bed. So I've got like three minutes to wait for the cooldown. Damn it. Right. So once this is cooled down, uh, I'm going to transfer over to the thingy, the uh, forge. Um, so I'll bring you back in a bit when this is cooled down. See you in a bit. Damn it! I travelled to the wrong bed! <laughs> so, I've ended up in uh, Alexis Arcade's uh, room. Damn it! <laughs> oh, I've got to wait for another four minutes. Uh, can I craft another bed up for the love of? Uh, yeah, I probably can. 
Oh, right then, so I'm going to craft a bed up, and then I'm going to spawn in the right place. Donut. Right then, this is where I wanted to be. <laughs> oh, dear me. So, uh, I overshot my landing, I went over that way, and I need to be this away. Uh, right, so, uh, I'm going to need some metal, and, yeah, I've got a buttload anyway. But, while I'm here, I shall go out and gather some uh, more metal. Have I got any in there? No, I don't think I did. I've just put it all in there. Awesome. Right then, guys, so, I'm over at the uh, Industrial Forge. And uh, now, I'm going to just basically grab a load of metal and... Uh, Turn this thing on and convert it into ingots while I'm uh, doing some taming. Nice. Uh, right then, guys. So I'll, I'll spare you the uh, boring bit of me just gathering stuff up. And what's my food like? Uh, okay. And I feel like the crops on the roof should give me a little bit of food. There we go. Nice. So I've got nine carrots. Nine carrots. And there's nine in there. Yep. Or ten. And so, yeah, so I've got a little bit of food here as well as uh, me, Argy. He's just stopping here just for defense purposes. Right there, guys. See you in a bit. Right there, guys. Uh, so I've crafted a. Well, I'd say I've crafted. I've stuck a load of. Oh, oh, words. I have stuck a load of metal in the forge and turned it on and left it. There we go. Brain works. So, while that is uh, percolating away, I'm off to find myself a uh, Paraceratherium. Now, I don't want to go too far because of getting it back, so I've got to, like, cross these little islands and stuff. Uh, I suppose if I go over to the village area, I could use a raft, uh, tame one up, and then fly across the river. Yeah, sort of, kind of. That could be a thing. Uh, unless there is a Paraceratherium in the actual village itself. I don't know if there is. Uh, if there is, then that, that would be super handy. That means we don't have to actually tame one up. Uh-huh, could be a thing. Right then. I'm off to go check. See you in a bit. Right, it doesn't look like anybody has one handy to hand. Um... So we've got like spinos and stegos and things like that, but not a paraceratherium. Uh, apparently nobody likes them on this server. Mm, never mind. Right then. So we'll have to uh, sort of kind of hunt one down. But we do have the means to get back. I mean, we can get we can use a raft as well. I mean, there's all rafts and all sorts of kind of uh, constructions lying about at our disposal, basically. Awesome. Right, I'm off to find me a Parasur, or Parasuratherium, not a Parasur. Uh-huh, right, see you in a bit, guys. Uh-huh, right then, so basically I just came round the corner and I've got this one. It's uh, 150 and they're like, oh, am I going to have enough trank Ooh, to do this? Right then, uh-huh. So, we're in a pretty good area. Uh, I only see some stupid dillos that might interfere with things, but uh, raptors and such like I don't see. I'll just have a little scout round before I start going crazy with. Uh, no, 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 stupid dillos. We're okay so far. Alright, looks like we should be able to uh, start this off. Right then. Shooting in the butt. Oh wow, 260. Oh, right. Oh, good. Oh, yeah. Be quite maneuverable. Oh, good. Go away. Go away. Ugh. Dodge and weave. Right there, guys. So it's the, oh, good. Normal malarkey of trying to stay alive and try to get knocking down. Oh, good. It's on me. It's on me. <laughs> oh, good. Right. You just stay there. I hope I whistled passive. Oh, are you stuck? Stupid. Oh, no, 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 no. Pego. Pego, damn it, I've put nothing in slot zero. Stupid Pegos. Uh, wow, wow, he's super bloody. <laughs> quick, quick, quick. Oh, no, no, no. No, it's all passive. There we go. Stupid. 
Right, you, you, you can kick his butt for a little while. Or are you running away? I think he might be down. Ah, oh, stupid Dillo. Get knocked out, stupid. There you go. No, 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 no water. No, 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 no. Oh. Oh, dear me. It's all going terribly wrong. Always does. Oh, no, he's nicked me narcotic. You dirty little savage. Whip. Whoa, 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 whoa. Get away, get away. What level is it? 96. Oh. No, 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 no. Oh, damn it. It's going to get away. Uh. Right. Give that back. Sausage. Oh, God, now what? Up on it. <laughs> Uh, right, where's this parasaur? Please say he's not gone down in the water. And I feel like you have. Huh? Where did you go? Uh huh. Did we. Did it get yet? Did it get eaten? Even? Oh, no, no, no. There it is, look. There it is. There it is, right, go to sleep. Go to sleep. And go to sleep. Go to sleep. And yes! Awesome. Right, I wasn't going to cut it, but meh, there you go. <laughs> so we've had uh, a bit of a thing. Right. Uh, whistle neutral. And follow me. But don't attack. There we go. Right there, guys. So, I've got a buttload of veggies and stuff in here. So, we'll transfer that over to the parasol. Because we don't have any uh, patchy kibble. Uh, or patchy eggs to make kibble, should I say. So, this guy is going to take a while to tame up, I think. So, we're going to uh, sort of just uh, rest here and uh, guard it. Anything crazy in the area? Let's just have a quick oop, up and up. No, we're good. Uh, yeah, we're good. So it's sort of herbivore-ish. Uh, so what I may do is, uh, while that's sort of percolating away, is just go around the corner and get myself a raft. Uh-huh. Can we scoot through this? Yeah. Oh, car no. Car no. No, 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 no. Right, we'll go that way around then, not that way. And I feel like we'll have a raft. Right then guys, so I'll get this teamed up. And we'll get it back to base and uh, get a saddle on it. Soon a bit. Right guys, oh, I'm back at base. I was going to... Um, like bring it across on the raft but I, I had to build up and uh, yeah I mean this guy took long enough to tame and I should have really built it while I was taming but I was doing some other things as well and uh, yeah so I crafted up a saddle instead and walked him across oh my that oh I forgot how, how hard and long these are actually to tame up uh, anyway, so uh, got a load of resources from the barge and stuff. So there's all sorts in here, bits and bobs of pieces and things. Um, right, so I need to go over to uh, what have you got in you? Oh, you've got bacon and all sorts in you. Uh, we'll take that and coal. Can we carry that at the same time? Yeah, we can. Awesome. And I just feel like we'll just dump them in there for now. We've got it. We've got a thing. We've got a thing. This is the thing. Uh, coal will go in there. And that will go in there. Uh, we need some more food. Awesome. Just in time. Oh, good. We ain't got none. We haven't got none. And we need some food. Yeah. So that's the thing. Right, we'll transfer that. And you've got some metal in here as well. So we'll uh, empty her out for his journey. 
Right, transfer that and start fire. Right, so uh, we'll take that off you, dude. And you've got some uh, iron in you, but we'll swap that out when we get up to the forge itself. And now we need to put this into the smithy because that's where things get crafted up. Uh, right then, saddles. Let's just have a peek. So I've learnt the Ingram for it, obviously, and yeah, we're all right for iron. So we don't need to. <laughs> oh no, no, yeah, we want the platform on sausage, and we're still all right for iron. Uh, but we're going to need some for the cannon. Awesome. Uh, hide and fiber. Uh, we need some more of that. Uh, we've got that. We, I say we've got that. And transfer. Awesome. So we've got the hide. And now we just need the fiber. So where is this? Uh, Therosinosaurus. Uh, we'll get some of that. Let's get some food. Excuse me, coming through. All this palaver for a cannon, and we're probably never ever going to use it. Oh dear me! Ugh. But uh, the things we do. Right, so we stocked up, and now I feel like I need my fibre, dude. Where's my fibre, dude? Damn it! Where are you, sausage? Uh, well, I see a Therosinosaurus over there. I don't know if he's actually got any fibre in him. Have you? And no, why would you have? And you don't have a saddle, so I can't ride you. So where's my dude? Uh, are you about somewhere, please? I feel like you should be here. I feel like he was here. Oh, God. I know. And you don't have a saddle, so I can't do an overview. Uh, la, 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 la. And we're Therosinosaurus missing. I saddled one of that. Where have you gone, sausage? Uh, it is a good idea to keep them on wonder at times, but this is one of them times when you think, nah, you should have just left your port. Right, guys, well, I'm going to have to do it the old fashioned way, so I'm going to get some fiber and I'll be back in a bit. Right, <clears throat> so I've got everything I need to craft myself a platform saddle and doing it. Oh, man, this is turning out to be a long one. And, oh man, it's so slow. So we've got a saddle and I've loaded up my Quetzal with some wood so we can convert that into charcoal. Now I'm guessing the industrial... Uh, Forge turns things into uh, no, 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 we don't want you, we want parasol. And you're over there, buddy. Right, so we'll take that off you. You can hold that, and you can hold that. Ta da! There we go. So we've got a platform uh, there on you, and now we need to go up to. So we've got a load of wood already loaded in. So we can uh, convert that into charcoal. There we go, well, that's the word. And then we can start making gunpowder because we need a bootload of that for the cannonballs themselves. Uh, so it's not just the ca cannon that we need metal for, it's for the cannonballs as well. And I think we need obsidian for that. Hmm, could be a thing. Right, see you in a bit. Right then. So, apparently, it's uh, not a thing. So, we can't uh, put... We can't put wood in to make charcoal in the industrial forge, which uh, I feel like we've kind of been cheated out of it because that's what they're supposed to do. I mean, we can turn it on. I mean, we've got all the metal. Uh, that's all the metal that we've... Uh, well, that I got gathered and cooked up, but... It won't let me do any charcoal, damn it. Uh, so I've had to basically place, oh God, wood. But it's going to take a boatload of time just to do that. Uh, what we got in here now? Oh, uh, we've got 17. Oh, that's just not enough. Uh, 
We've got the um, alchemy bench, which converts that into... Uh, so that'll be double that amount. So, right, we've got 17 and craft all 17. So how many do we get out of that? So that's going to do... Yeah, it's going to do double the amount. There we go, 34. Still not enough, and it's going to take a long time. Um, I'm probably going to have to build, like, a boatload of these fires up here. Uh, because I didn't really want to have to um, convert the resources, take them back and then do it down there. I wanted to kind of do it all in one place. So I've bought a load of flint up here because uh, we can get stone, but we can't get any sort of kind of flint. Uh, oh, yeah, I ain't got no tools anyway. So, yeah, we get stone from these. So we're all right for stone. I say all right. We don't get much. We don't get much stone, and you're sort of kind of full on things. Um, oh, right, we'll transfer that out. And, oh no, can't move. Sausage. Transfer that back. So, we can get stone, uh, we just can't get flint uh, from these rocks. So, we just get uh, limestone, carbon, and metal. We don't get any flint whatsoever. Uh -huh. So we just need the bare rocks. So I've been transporting them and uh, just uh, doing the other things as well. So it's a bit of jiggery pokery, but we uh, we get in there. Uh, so I've just got to wait now until all that converts into carbon, unless I can build some more um, fires, which I think I can do. Um, right, camp. Come and crafting. Want a large, a big campfire. So we need uh, a bit of thatch. Uh, have we got that up here? Uh, I feel like we should have. No. Darn it. No, I didn't get no thatch. Uh, unless I got some on my Anki. I don't think we have. I've just been in his inventory while it like I think it was just fibre. It was. It was it was. So I can't even build a fire. So I'll have to make a note of that the next time I come up. <sighs> right. I think I'm just gonna wait a bit until um that charcoal percolates up a bit. <sighs> See you in a bit. Right there guys, so oh, oh. I've built myself some campfires and I've been um well, ooh, light fire, sausage. So I've been filling them up and taking the charcoal out and then I've been transferring it over. Obviously I've been back to base and got some stuff and crafted some stuff up as well. And so these are the steps I've been taking to make uh, gunpowder. So uh, you'll have to let me know guys, I mean, I, this is part of the cannon build itself and these are the steps I've actually gone through to get uh, to get this far. And, well, you can see I've got a buttload of gunpowder and I've also done some uh, base modifications as well. Excuse me, coming through. So I've built myself a water tower. Uh huh, right, water tower. Use item to fill up the tank. Right, do we do we have water in here? Do we have water in here? Yes. No. Yes, water tower. Uh huh. Not irrigated. So do we need to put a pipe in? Well, I've already built a reservoir as well. Because I've been caught out a couple of times. Uh, I know it does rain quite a lot up here. But because I've been uh, running about and uh, getting hot uh, in this place. I've uh, I've had to <laughs> basically do a nosedive off uh, the cliff with a bird and get some water. Uh, so um, uh, I've crafted up a little water thing. I've crafted up a water tower but I'm not quite sure how the uh, Dubraferkin works. So we can access it, and uh, do we have to put a pipe? Now I've cra crafted some pipes. Haha! -ha. 
we do. How oh, then? Oh dear. Right. So I've got that. And I feel like we need a tap on there. Right, I've got a tap on there. But I feel like we need to construct another tap. Um, I can do a stone tap, I suppose. Mm -hmm. So if I go and get some uh, wood and... Excuse me, coming through a bit more. Uh, wood and stone. Now, I hope I haven't used all that stone up. And no. Right. Uh, tap. Awesome. Inventory. And use. Now it's a bit... It's hanging a bit far out, but I think... I think we're good be good. Now then, can I... Yes. So there we go. And we can also... Can we fill? No. So it's got like a little inventory, but you can't fill from it. Hmm. That's the thing. Never mind. Anyway, so we've got... Oh, it's irrigated as uh, crops as well. Has it done that one? Not irrigated. Never mind. So yeah, so that's the thing. And uh, yeah, so as Carl, uh, I feel like we've grown enough um, gunpowder now because uh, this um, alchemy bench is super awesome. So I've got like a lot of gunpowder. I feel like we can make cannonballs for days. And uh, there's a little bit more in there. Let's take that as well. And I've got a buttload of uh, spark powder because I went uh, when I went crafting. I got some flint as well. So we let that pot, uh, percolate up. Now I've made these big campfires because they hold a lot. Uh, forges take a long time to burn, which is a good thing when you're processing metal, but not when you want uh, charcoal. Uh, I would have thought that the forge itself, unless it's a bug and they need to fix it, uh, I thought that would process uh, charcoal or wood into charcoal. So that just seems a bit ridiculous, really, that you can't actually do that. But you can in the uh, normal arc. Damn it. Anyway, so we've come up with this solution. Uh, it's not the best, but eh. It's working out a little better. Right, guys. Oh, Now I'm going to finally get back. I'm going to take this metal. And we're going to craft a cannon. And cannonballs. Awesome. Right then, people. See you in a bit. This is it, guys. The culmination of today's events. Oh, for the love of. It's been a long one, I tell you. Right. Cannon. So we need 950 ingots, 200 fiber, 150 hide, 120 thatch, and 300 cemented paste. Crafting it. And cannonballs. I feel like we should craft all 12. <laughs> awesome. Right. So they weigh... Uh -huh. How much do they weigh? Uh, we'll just transfer them across. Keep going till we get full. And we can take quite a few. And we've took them all. We've took them all. Right then. Let's go place it. On your butt. Let's uh, shoot things out of your butt. Right then. Uh -huh. So. I'm hoping it looks a little different. But. You never know. They might have cheaped out on the things. And I feel like it's the same. <laughs> oh dear me. Right then. Is it? Can we move it? That's the thing we want to know. Uh, we'll just place it sort of kind of there. Uh-huh. So we uh, we get like a little swishy bit, but can we rotate it? Uh, I don't know. It's the same. <laughs> you cheap wild card. Why can't you make things a little different? Right then. Uh, aim up, down, down. Aim right, 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 left. Aim right. So I feel like they should do a little bit, yeah, 
there should be like something on it where you can go into it and move it instead of moving it a little bit uh-huh right now then I suppose we best shoot something right then buddy let's uh, go over this away and I feel like we need some juicy right and big dinos there's normally a Bronto there was a Bronto stomping around here but he's sort of despawned damn it why'd you despawn when I want to shoot you oh well right I'll go and find something guys and then uh, we'll shoot it right then see you in a bit Right then, I feel like this is a sort of wavy target, but <laughs> we're in the... Oh, it, like, it moves! Stop moving! Oh, dear me, we're going to have to, like, do it this way. And... Oh, no, now he's going out of distance. Oh, dear me, this is this is a terrible uh, base defence. Oh, God. Look. We're doing more damage just on the parasol, never mind anything else. Come out, sausage. Get out. Get away. Stupid bugs. Right then. Oh, uh, I see you. Right then. And. <laughs> hmm. Maybe. Uh, aim down, even. And. Aim down. Right then. That is on target. Load the ball. Quick. Fire. Oh, yes! So we did a buttload of damage then. And he's sort of kind of mad. So let's... Uh... Yeah, you're for it now. You are for it now. And... Access inventory, quick. He's getting away. He's getting away. Fire. Oh, boom. Got him again. Wow, he's, he's super strong. Is he dead? No! It's just a little bit bloody. <laughs> Don't make me chase you. Don't make me chase you. Hell for the love of. Yeah. This is a... Uh, kind of... Yeah. I'm guessing it's more for like... Structures things. So if you put it on a raft... Can you even place it on a raft? I don't know. Oh yeah, you're for it now. I'm just going to get me... Get me bearings. Right then, and uh, uh, all we're there. Fire! Oh, 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 oh! Straight over your head! Oh, we killed something, I think. <laughs> we killed a dodo. We're a cannibal. Awesome! <laughs> we're a wrecking machine. We are a wrecking machine. Yeah, I feel like uh, the turning and the aiming could be a little better. You know, if you had some, like, sort of sights or something to, to go off or some sort of register. I mean, this just this doesn't really do a thing. <laughs> and you, you only get, like, a little bit of aim at a time. So it's just basically like the standard arc cannon. Nothing new. Nothing really... Eh. I thought they'd uh, I thought they'd go to town on it at least at least do something a little different but no they basically copied and pasted it right then <gasps> don't make me shoot you oh god we're getting night time gamma gamma four good even gamma four again Well, um, I mean, we could have killed him on a dino for for all the good that this has done. If we got a high level dino, we just we'd have wiped him out already, surely. <laughs> oh, that's it. And no. Oh yeah, you for it now, buddy. I don't know what application you could actually use this for. And by the time we get there, he's going to heal up. Fire! Got him! At last! I am victorious! Oh god! Nearly! I'm getting my butt kicked. 
Stamp on him, buddy. Stamp on him. Don't make me load it up. You get him. <laughs> right then, guys. Oh, dear me. I'm just, I'm just along for the ride now. Look at the balance on that guy. Look, look, there we go. Not even phased by it. 45 degree angle. What angle? Awesome. <laughs> oh, dear me. Right then. It's been a long one. And it's not really uh, that fruitful, really. So it's just a standard sort of arc cannon. Nothing new. Nothing fancy. No different turning circle. No aim or anything like that. Huh. Bit lackluster. Never mind. So, uh, what's left me to do is to wave and see you in the next one.